Rwando election, votes sold for 1,000 to 7,000 Naira. Yaga. Good morning, everybody. Good afternoon. Good evening. Hope you all are doing very well. We from Greenfield Media are just saying thank you so much for all your support. Thanks for coming to this channel. We are really grateful and we say God bless you. The news reaching us is that the votes were actually sold in Ando State and were ranging from 1,000 Naira to 7,000 Naira. Can you imagine? Anyways, guys, let's go into the news. A civil rights organization, Yaga Africa, has condemned the high incidence of vote trading recorded in the October 10 Ondo State Governorship election. The organization said it was disturbing that the criminal act of vote buying happened under the nose of security agents. The executive director of Yaga Africa, Samson Itodo, made this known while speaking on a television program in Abuja on Monday morning. Itodo, who stated that Yaga Africa deployed 646 observers for the election, said, The vote buying that we saw in this election is quite disturbing. Nigeria needs a national campaign and a national discussion around vote buying. He said the situation where elections are determined by the highest bidder or the highest spender makes a mockery of our democracy. It diminishes human dignity, but most importantly, it also questions the legitimacy of the election outcomes. For Saturday election, votes were traded between 1,000 Naira and 7,000 Naira in the state. Continuing, Itodo said, What is disturbing is the level of impunity of political actors who engage in this illegal and corrupt act. You go to polling stations and polling stations have become marketplaces where in the full glare of security agents who are deployed to the polling station, people are just buying votes and nobody is reprimanding them or arresting them. What this tells you is that it appears we have accepted this as a norm and as part of our electoral process and it is very, very sad. The menace of vote buying is a governance problem. It is an indictment on the political class that they fail to lift people out of poverty, to divide the dividends of democracy, and so they use this against the people. The Yaga boss, however, condemned the Independent National Electoral Commission for the successful conduct of the election. He noted that widespread violence was not recorded on the election day, which showed that the peace accord signed by the political parties was effective. What we saw in Ondo State is an improvement from the Edo election, where INEC improved on logistics deployment for the election. Guys, this is what has happened. The Yaga Africa has come to the come to the world, come to national television to say they were buying and selling votes. Can you imagine what has gone wrong? But this was what we were up against. This was what we were fighting against. We wanted our voices to count. We wanted our voices to actually make a difference. But no, because votes were being bought in the election that happened two days ago. Does this mean that Akira Dulu, Akira Dulu did not actually merit the win? Does this mean that anything or this election is going to be nulled? We would like to hear your vote. We like, would like to hear your, your comments. Sorry. We would like to see what you all think about this. Is this what we, 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 are, we, are, we are going to be dealing with in Nigeria? We thought all this was over. Anyways, guys, if you've made it to the end of this video, please do not forget to comment or even subscribe. If you haven't, until we meet you next time, do take care of yourself. God bless you.